Millennial parents look to test scores, along with information about a school's culture, extracurricular offerings, and graduation rates in deciding whether a school is a good school. We asked our focus group participants to sketch out for us what criteria they'd use to measure the quality of a school. I had attendance, classroom test scores, classroom participation, how well children pay attention, and how interactive are the teachers with the kids. Shika, what does your grading scale for a school look like? Um, student pass rate, environment, student teacher ratio, and communication. Communication is a big theme that's come up a lot. What's a good way to sort of measure how well a school is communicating? Um, how are they, their method of getting the information out to parents? Some people don't have email and um, some prefer mail. Um, so it's just having a multiple methods of making sure that the information is getting out to everyone. Um, I said safety, teacher, teaching staff per child, your graduation rate, the disciplinary measures and procedures, communication, staff to parent, parent to staff, and SOL or testing pass-fail rate. In our survey, the top three pieces of information parents would like to use to evaluate a school are how well a school performs on state tests, 53% of respondents chose that as one of their top responses, whether a school has a positive culture, 42% chose that as one of their top data points, and whether a school offers good extracurricular activities at 40%. Following those criteria, parents said they would consider graduation rates and what percentage of kids go on to college as key proof points. Uh, I could have put a million things down, but I just made it to four. Um, overall testing and grades, uh, community activities, safety, and after school activities. What's a good way to measure something like community activities or after school activities? I don't think that there's enough being done in the community nowadays. I think that they could be doing all kinds of things. Community garden, I mean, like it's going to be so hard for people to understand how we're going to feed ourselves, you know, when no one knows how to grow anything nowadays. <laughs> you know, it doesn't always grow in a package. The bottom line, millennial parents may be skeptical of tests when it comes to their own child, but they think they're a good way to make sure a school overall is doing what it needs to in some core subjects.